We live in a very unsavory world sometimes. But there is good news. There is an answer and there is hope. See, life sometimes is like a bad experience at a restaurant. You go to a restaurant, take the family out, you, you have a great expectation of great service, great food, just a great time. And when you leave there, never wanting to come back, service was horrible, the food was awful, I'll never go back no matter what anybody else says. Uh, it gives you kind of a picture of the way life is. Very unsavory, doesn't taste good, and people want out. And that's why sometimes people take their own life, because they just had enough of the unsavory. Uh, the thing about living for God and even thinking about the concept of walking with God uh, is that God himself becomes savory in the midst of a very unsavory world, your unsavory world. Uh, you can talk about nobody else really but yourself. Uh, you can always look at the world around you and see all the negative, but when God can become a positive in your negative, he can change your thinking. He can become something that's savory, something that tastes good. We all love something that tastes good. We, we love good food. Uh, we're, we're a place, every place in the world loves good food. And we love things that are hot and, or cold based on what we want. Uh, but when life itself becomes something that we don't want and we just want a way out, before you do something dumb like take your life, consider Jesus Christ. Take a look at the Word of God. Consider what we're saying. Consider what somebody's saying about Jesus himself and say maybe he's the savory answer that I'm looking for. Maybe I'll just take one moment of my life and just taste and see if the Lord is what I'm looking for. And we can promise you by our own experience that he is. Uh, he just has this wonderful way of just surrounding things that are just not right. Uh, he specializes in taking things that are broken and uh, fixing them. Uh, he specializes in surrounding storms when our life is just a big mess. And so we just encourage you to keep on listening and watching and and we hope that you'll hear something that will start tasting good. And that's what this is all about. We know it tastes good for ourselves because we've been tasting of this for a long, long time. Uh, we can talk to you about, you know, uh, a lot of things. I've tasted this and I've tasted that. But if you haven't tasted it for yourself, you'll never know. But if you start tasting, and you can taste by just starting to believe. Many people just don't understand how powerful believing is, but it's really powerful. Because God will start showing himself to you if you'll start turning takes a lot of effort sometimes, like turning a big truck. If you've never driven one before and you've jumped in the driver's seat, it takes a lot of effort sometimes to turn something very big. Our lives are very big and very complicated and sometimes very unsavory. Uh, but if we just start turning a little bit from the heart and start believing, God can do something with it. God bless you.